Hello and welcome to a Sappho and the Mountain Hare meditation. Lichens seem like oddities to some and wonders to others. Small crusts on trees and rock, occupants of cracks in walls and pavements. They find safe places. A symbiosis of algae and fungi, where one depends on the other. The fungi providing structure and mass, and the algae providing food through photosynthesis. And so they form two parts of one whole. Largely in temperate and arctic areas, they can also be found in deserts. More important to the lichen than the habitat is its microhabitat, the immediate place where you sit. Safety, security, and a place to be. Let's explore our immediate surroundings and what it is to be content within them. Before we start, make yourself comfortable. Pull together some extra cushions if you feel like it, or a blanket for comfort or warmth. You can sit or lie down in any position you feel like being in. Wriggle and stretch until you feel at home. Have a look around you. Where are you? Is it familiar or new? Are there walls, trees, sky? What's right in front of you? What colors are there? Or tones and contrasts if you struggle with color? What are the textures around you? Is whatever is in front of you rough or smooth? Is it dry or damp? Soft or hard? If you feel like it, you could close your eyes now, but it's completely up to you. There may be noises around you. Can you tune in to the furthest sound? And then the closest sound. Perhaps the sound was near whatever you were looking at a moment ago. Sound waves are movements of the air. Does it feel like you move out to the sound? Or that the sound comes to you? Sounds cause vibrations of the air, like the wind makes the air sing. Perhaps you can feel yourself breathing, with the air exhaled blowing away, and the air inhaled moving closer. Your shoulders might rise and fall, or your stomach expand and fall in again, pushing and pulling on the air. The 
the wind moves, some of our lichen friends are around. The ones that don't fix themselves to one place. But at the moment, we have our safe surface. And that spot where you are at at present. You could reach a hand down to touch it. Explore its texture. Your seat. Couch. Bed. Blanket. Whatever is holding you. Run your fingers across it. You could pinch it. Simply stroke it. Or just touch lightly. Is it smooth or rough? Warm or cool? Soft or firm? Are there seams, buttons, ridges, joints? Or is it one smooth surface? Surfaces in nature vary too. Some are rough like bark. Some have cracks to hide in like rocks. And some are smoother like leaves. Like you, different lichens prefer different surfaces. Do you have a favourite material or texture? Or do you find something interesting in everything? Do your thoughts flow to a favourite garment, cloth or object that you like to touch? Or perhaps thoughts are jumping between themselves or somewhere else completely. Just going with the texture of your mind. Take a moment to explore where you are at, what pictures, words or other thought materials are there. Is whatever you are sitting or lying on supportive and stable? How are you connected to the ground? Through the feet of the couch? Or are your own feet on the ground? Soil lichens bring stability to the ground, binding it in a cryptogram carpet providing a barrier to erosion by wind or heavy rain, helping the ground absorb the water rather than have it wash away. Is your shelter providing you protection? Perhaps you're warm and safe in your house or room or in a favourite outdoor location supported by the ground under you. And we can appreciate our shelter and feel content to have it, feel satisfied to have found it for ourselves. How do you feel in your personal space? Would you like to explore? Are you alert or at ease? Are your senses attuned to what's going on around you or just focused on the spot where you are?
perhaps on how it feels against your body. The textures? Is your breathing slow and steady? Like a like in his two parts, there is a completeness and contentment in our role and place. A satisfaction with the here and now. Do you feel ease and a sense of belonging to wherever you are? Your small microcosm of a chair or couch, or patch of ground or floor? Are you or can you feel pleased to have this small universe of your own? To have created a small spot where you are at ease, a physical place and a moment in time. Are you feeling relaxed or other spots of tension? Perhaps find a bit of your body that feels at ease. It might be a toe, a leg or an arm. Can you focus on the feeling of ease? Is it possible to let the feeling spread through your body? If not, just think of your substrate your chair or surface that is supporting you. How does it feel to be able to relax and be supported? Like the fungal part of the lichen provides support, and the algae provides food, every part of you belongs to the other part, a natural and amazing life form. Your feet relaxing into your leg. Relaxing into your hip. Relaxing into your back and stomach. Relaxing into your chest. Relaxing into your neck and head. And what is your breathing like now? Steady and slow, or perhaps steady and fast? Shallow or deep? Perhaps think again of your breath moving in and out like currents of air. Can you hear it? What other noises are close by?
noises are there a little further away, in the same room, perhaps? Moving further away again, what does the external acoustic environment sound like? Is it melodious, disharmonious, rhythmic, or random? And as we prepare to end our meditation, perhaps open your eyes and look around you again. Once again, looking at the patterns and textures, the colours and tones. Where the light falls and where there are shadows. Where there is openness and where there is shelter. If you feel like it, stretch out and move your head to look around. To finish, take a couple of deep breaths and sigh or yawn if you want. And maybe shuffle or wriggle a little to wake up your body. Thanks for joining me in this meditation on lichens and contentment. Keep on until and on.